Hunting is a big part of Red Dead 2. Animals provide Arthur with a source of meat to keep his health topped up, while pelts can be sold for a nice chunk of change at one of the many butchers. But if you really want to embrace the big game, you're going to need to go after one of the game's 16 legendary animals. Once you find and kill each beast, you can harvest their pelts and organs, and then trade these fleshy trophies with the trapper in Saint Denis for rare outfits and weapon accessories. Like fancy furry holsters. Oh, I'd pay just about any price for this. Here's where to find all 16 legendary animals. 1. The Grizzly Bear. Grizzlies East, Amberino. This utter unit is a damn sight more homicidal than your average bear. You'll first encounter it in Chapter 2, while hunting with Hosea during the exit pursued by a bruised ego mission. At this point, you'll probably only have a pistol and bow when starting the mission, so there's a good chance you won't be able to kill the bear. But worry not. Just return to its hunting spot north of Okria's Run in Grizzlies East a few hours later when you've got the likes of a Springfield or Rolling Block Rifle, and a few well-placed shots of express ammo should floor the brute. Two, legendary buck, Big Valley, West Elizabeth. The buck hangs out in the forests of Big Valley, which you can find a short ride northwest from the town of Strawberry. A rolling block rifle loaded with express ammo should take this animal down in a single shot. Three, Bighorn Ram, Cattail Pond, New Hanover. This sizeable sheep grazes to the east of Cattail Pond, located a short ride from Valentine. Like many of the legendary animals on this list, a rifle will kill the ram with the least fuss possible. We put ours in the ground with a shot to the heart, and then a second round to the head. Four, legendary white bison, Lake Isabella, Amberino. This beefy customer resides in the chilly climes of Lake Isabella to the north of Grizzlies West. Bison's clue trail usually spawns on the slopes near the frozen lake, so head over there and get hunting. A high powered rifle is the way to go here and should put it in the ground quite easily. Five, Legendary Wolf, Cotora Springs, Amberino. You really can't miss this wolf's hunting spot. This graceful predator can be found among the geezers in Cotora Springs, southwest of the Wapiti Indian camp. Thanks to the beast's close proximity to the reservation, it's likely that you'll stumble across the springs while completing one of Rainfall's story missions. A single shot to the heart with the Springfield rifle should put Wolfie down in one. Six, legendary moose, Roanoke Ridge, Amberino. This moose demands a powerful weapon. We suggest the Carcano rifle if you want to take it down in as few shots as possible. 
You'll find it around a wooded lake near Renoki Ridge. It's surprisingly swift, so make sure you use your dead eye and aim for the heart and neck. Seven, Legendary Beaver, Butcher Creek, Limon. You can kill this obsessingly cute albino beaver with one good shot from the Varmint rifle. Predictably, it can be found near a small dam on the riverbanks near Butcher Creek, which is just to the west of the Van Horn trading post. Legendary Boar. This animal can be found in the marshlands north of Lagres, in the Limon region of the map. He will also happily gore you on sight, so make sure you take a weapon with a fair bit of power. A bow with a poisoned arrow or the Springfield rifle are both good candidates to put him down. Nine, Legendary Coyote, Old Greenbank Mill, New Hanover. Aside from the panther, which we'll get to later, this is the one we had most trouble getting to spawn. You can find it in the hills of Scarlet Meadows, but should you spook it, the beast will show off its roadrunner shaming sprint and disappear. So make sure you put it down with a single clean shot using the Springfield rifle. Ten, legendary fox, Matlock Pond, Limon. You can find this fox near Matlock Pond, which lies just to the north of the town of Rhodes. Try and get it in one shot, because if you miss, it will scurry off into the bushes and can be really difficult to catch up with. Another good candidate for using Deadeye and the Varmin rifle. Eleven, Legendary Elk, Bacall Station, Cumberland Forest. You can find this grazer just east out of Bacall Station in the Cumberland Forest region. Once you track the first couple of clues, you'll have no trouble spotting the herbivore thanks to its blisteringly white coat. A Springfield rifle loaded with express or high velocity ammo should take it down in two or three shots, provided you aim for its vitals. Twelve, legendary bull gator, Lake, Bayou Noir. This bull gator is super, super tough. More dinosaur than gator, this gargantuan swamp menace can be found in the Bayou Noir, west of Lake, and just a few minutes ride north of Saint Denis. To get this creature to show, you must first complete the Chapter Four story mission, Country Pursuits. The bull gator is the strongest animal in the game, so we advise sniping it from a distance using the rolling block rifle. Just be warned, the monster will charge at you and is terrifyingly quick.
The next four venture into areas of the map which can be considered spoilers, so be warned. If you don't want to have anything spoiled, stop now and come back after you've finished Chapter 6. 13. Legendary Cougar. Gaptooth Ridge, New Austin. You can find this furry fiend prowling near Gaptooth Ridge, a little west of Tumbleweed in New Austin. Once you make it spawn by tracking its various fur remains and paw marks, stay alert as the cougar is extremely difficult to hit outside of Deadeye mode. While you should really use a rifle for a clean kill, we also take a semi-automatic shotgun just in case you find yourself within nibbling distance of the big cat. Fourteen, Legendary Pronghorn, Rio del Lobo Rock, New Austin. You can find this antelope hybrid near Rio del Lobo Rock in the Rio Bravo region. Annoyingly, this one was rather too fond of life, escaping from us several times. So to give yourself the best chance of a clean kill, use the scent remover so it doesn't sniff you out as you approach, and go for the bow to put the animal down with a single arrow. Fifteen, legendary katana bison. You can find this beast northwest of Manteca Falls in New Austin. We found it to be surprisingly docile, and it barely batted an eye in Arthur's presence. That is until we started shooting it in the face. Take your trusty Springfield rifle, four rounds of express ammo, and that should be enough to get the job done. <laughs> Legendary Gaiagaro Panther, Bulba Blaine, Limo. This is the most elusive legendary animal in the game, and the one you're going to have to invest the most time into before you can proudly take its pelt to a trapper in Saint Denis. The stealthy cat only spawns once you reach rank 9 of the Master Hunter Challenge, and to get to this level, you'll have to do the following, in this order. Prepare yourself. First, skin three deer. Then get three perfect quality rabbit pelts. Track 10 animal species using your binoculars. Get a clean kill after calling an animal five times. Skin three black or grizzly bears. Kill five cougars with your bow, then skin them. Use bait to lure and kill both a herbivore and a predator. Catch three fish without a fishing rod, so shoot them. And finally, catch an opossum playing possum. They act dead when you get too close. Once you've done all that, in that order, no skinning bears before tracking animals or it won't count, the panther should appear. Obviously getting to this hunter rank takes a lot of time and dedication to this one challenge. So long in fact that even after 70 plus hours, we still haven't done it. But once you do, you'll find the panther here, prowling to the west of Shady Bell in Limon. So that's how to kill all 16 legendary animals in Red Dead Redemption 2. Let us know if you've got any tips for hunting them in the comments below. Click the boxes on the left for more content from us. And don't forget to hit that big button in the middle to subscribe for more gaming news, reviews, previews and features right here on Games Radar Plus.